Hello, J-Crafters! This is Nate, back for Season 2, Episode 1 of the Northcraft FTB Series! Woo! It's back! After so long, I found my Windows 7 64-bit disc. Woo! And I'm now able to record and do FTB! I'm happy! <laughs> yes. Um, I have restarted. I am... On the outskirts of a town, pardon the graphic settings, I actually should turn them up. Um, I'm testing out an NVIDIA of... an NVIDIA. An NVIDIA GeForce... That rain. 9800 GT. 512 megs... It has 512 megs of G... Or, no, regular DDR3 memory. Uh, not GDDR memory like my... Uh, prior ATI Radeon 4890 had. HD 4890, correction. But I'm just trying it out. I'm going to put this card in a different system and make a LAN party system. But that's not important. What is important is why is my frame rate not locked while recording? Hang on. I need to fix that. That's better. I want to lock myself at 30 frames per second. That way it's not up and down, up and down, up and down, up and down. But I have not set up any fancy AE system. Um, and instead of seeping off these, this particular town's power which you can see is running through these hardened energy conduits, which I need to turn off that stupid name tally thing. Um, I'm actually going to be setting up this... That's just lovely. I have a um, phone call as I'm recording. Wow. I'll be right back. And I'm back. Um, sorry for the interruption. Right, so the first thing I'm going to do... Actually, I need to set a computer name. Uh, more label set. Anyway, uh, <laughs> damn. The fir <laughs> pardon me. The first thing I'm going to do. Uh, Got to talk. Uh, calm down. I haven't recorded in a while. You can tell I'm kind of. I almost said giggity. Giddy? Glee? I don't know. As I quietly sip my tea. I am going to. Computer label cleared. Labels. Set Goober. So this computer is now Goober. Um, I'm going to make Goober. Oh shit, that's not what I wanted. I want edit startup. Goober is going to control these doors. So you have to have a password to enter because I don't necessarily want people to get in and mess with my machines per se. OS. Pull event raw. By the way, I've got. I have had figured this out many moons ago, and I figured, oh, why not put it on camera one day? Anywho, um, OS pull event equals OS pull event raw. Basically, this computer will no longer be used for anything else. I'm waiting for a creeper to blow me up. This computer will no longer be used for anything other than this door lock. I've already got the redstone hooked up, too. So, in order to... To make this door lockable, we do while true do term. Now let me move my mouse. Mouth term dot clear term dot set cursor pos one one print enter your password password. I won't spell it right just for that reason. Enter your password. Local input equals read. Boom, 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 boom. And then we'll do if input equals equals. Basically, between those two par uh, not parentheses, quotations, you put your password. And I'm not going to show that on camera because if I did then people who watch this video would know what my password is, and I'm not going to do that because anyone on the server could watch it. Redstone.setOutput... I think I've got the cable running underneath, so bottom... True. Button. That's button. I need to do that. I need to put the uh, quotation. Bottom. True. Sleep to... Then redstone dot set output bottom again false and end. Now I'm going to quickly assign a password and then reboot the computer to make sure everything's working. 
And now the almighty test. Reboot. Not reboot. Reboot. Goodbye. Aha! It was working! So if I enter in... Oh. Don't! What did I do wrong? Uh, now if I do edit startup, it'll show the password. So I'm not going to do that. I'm in English 11 honors. You think I could spell. Reststone set output? Redstone. Oh, damn, you can see the password. Well, I had. You know what I set it to now, so I'm gonna change that so it's not the same. Okay, upon changing the password and rebooting the computer! Enter! Goodbye. Enter your password. Aha! Perfect. And then the computer is back to its original state. So now I need to set the machines up. Which is more than a little bit of fun. So, for my source of power, I've already got a full redstone energy cell, two steam dynamos, I should have four golden fluid pipe. Why don't I have four? I should have four! Why don't I have four? I should have more. There it is. Six. So, let's see. So, I got the steam dynamo. I've got an un unlimited source of charcoal, which I'm going to use to power these dynamos, even though it's not uber efficient if my knowledge is up to date. Let's see. What I'll do is I'll get some oak wood. Now I'm going to, not really any type of wood, it doesn't matter. As one of my friends on the server, Tijman DF, I believe his username is, he's a uh, maintainer, has a public farm that has excess uh, wood, saplings, and something else. Um, I should shut this so someone else is allowed in. He has a public wood farm that well a public shop that's powered off wood and with uh places where people can um get extra things from deep storage units deep storage unit is basically a a storage unit or a storage thing with a shit ton of storage in it that's new that was not here last night well i howled it out hmm i wonder oh well anyway <laughs> um redwood trees are huge damn anywho um I'm going to power... Oh, hello there. This guy's probably going to kick my ass through the server lag. Eh. Ooh! Protection 2. Protection 2. Damn, Gina. Okay, um... I might have to save that and actually wear it, because I don't have any armor, as you can see. I'll wear it now. <laughs> Butter man! With an arrow in the head. <laughs> Um, let's see. So I'm going to be setting up these equ or these equipment. This equipment. Do I have any buckets? Because I need a, an unlimited amount of water. Where is... Oh, I'll just make a bucket. Now, the server lag right now is not that bad. And for those who are wondering, there are more people online. But I have the chat turned off. Uh, so, explic so explicatives? Explicatives? Whatever are basically, I don't, I, don't, I don't have to worry about offending anyone, so password, password, password. And password, password, password is not the password, so keep guessing what the password is. Oh, I'm, 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 I'm gonna flip. I'm, oh, damn it. By no means am I a perfectionist in Minecraft, but I'd like my buildings to look at least halfway decent. So if there are not match, so if there are not any, not any, not any, any, but not if there, damn! If there aren't matching blocks, I kind of go a little. So, if since those blocks were sandstone, they don't look good. I don't. I did. Uh, I did not want those there. So yeah, you get the drift. Um. Let's see. So this is going to be fairly simple. As these, what I'm doing is a fairly simple task. Password, password, password. Way too long. Password, password, password. In. Okay, so I've got the unlimited water supply. I need my aqueous accumulator. Where is my aqueous accumulator? Oh, by the way, I'm putting up another website under the Jcraft uh, Weebly account. So eventually you'll be able to go to Jcraft we jcraftftb.weebly.com. I don't believe it's up right now. I don't think I hit the publish button, but if I did, you're going to get a whole website full of nothing. And that basically covers FTP, FTP, how to start up, what I'd recommend doing. And this is just going off my personal opinion and recommendation of what you should do. For example, as to take a sip of tea. 
as you know, I spilled on myself. I prefer going with IC2. However, IC2 is not the world's greatest. Oh, you're kidding me. It's raining on my parade. However, IC2 is not the world's best mod. I mean, guess you got the nuclear reactor, which can produce metric shifts in the power. The mass fabricator is freaking awesome. These were from a friend, Logan55, and I know I'm going to be hungry here soon, so I may as well eat them. Let me make them. Raw meat ingot. Raw meat nuggets. How do you make... Oh, damn it. Cooked meat nugget. You make from a raw meat nugget. You make from a raw meat ingot. Which make from a raw meat block. Which, ugh! I don't know how. Let's see. Redstone energy cells because I'm cheap and I didn't use the hardened ones. Blah, 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 blah. Going to hook these up to the front of these dynamos. These dynamos, unfortunately, do not move. I'm going to whack them with my crescent hammer. Whack, whack! And put the energy cell in between. Why that is draining is beyond me. RF is not going in there. Wait a minute. I'm trying to remember. I think blue is out. And I think I have a pulverizer to test this theory. No, I have regular old furnace. Right. Um... <laughs> Oh crap, I think... <laughs> I think that, that's funny. I think... Uh, I think orange is out and blue is in. I need to go get that charcoal that I've been working with. Um, That was limited to a thousand Y, I don't know. But theoretically... <clears throat> So long as I, that's fully charged up, I really shouldn't have to worry about running those steam dynamos too much. Um, most likely just let them run when I'm offline, but I don't have... I don't think I have access to world anchors because I'm not a donator. But that's a big deal. Um, they can run when I'm online. Oh well. <laughs> oh, it took enough time, so let's see. This is the public AE system. Let's see. So I put the charcoal... Good, and I put two stacks in. So I get two stacks out. Anyone here else hear that? I hear a clicking. What the hell? Huh. Hmm. Interesting. That might be a cause of lag. Do you hear that? Sounds like a clock or a lever of some sort. That might be causing some lag. Hmm. I'll have to point this video out to Loyal, the server owner, the Loyal one. The underscore Loyal underscore one. Maybe he should check that out, as clocks do cause lag, so... I have to say something to him now. You can supposedly eat these. Oh wow. Huh. That's probably gonna be what I'm eat from I'm going to eat from now on. But let's see, so I'm gonna have the battery quote unquote battery out there. And I'm gonna have to think. Where can I run the wire in here? As I wanna have by the way, that this is an elevator block. I wanna have all my machines up here and do like an automated storage system to where everything is down here. Pardon my burping. <laughs> mm. To go up, just double tap space. To go down, double tap shift. Sticky key. Did it two times. Sticky keys, by the way, is recommended to be turned off for the duration of playing FTB. As I've learned that the hard way. <laughs> Let's see. What else? I can dump most of my inventory away in these chests. In these chests. Can't talk right. So, 
that Redstone Energy Bloody Blarg is full, then I'm not going to worry about running those Steam Dynamos and chewing up my charcoal supply, as I've already got a lot of stacks of card charcoal up here, or in here, rather. By the way, I had someone give me 15 diamonds on my first day in, just for holding their spot while they teleported somewhere. So, to prove there are nice people on this earth still, that is proof. I used one diamond to make the redstone energy thingy. The redstone fluxer, mctuxer, or whatever. Um, I don't think there's anything else I really had in mind. So, I'm going to say that's it for episode one. Tune into episode two where I run power in here and probably frustrate myself greatly. In the meantime, catch y'all later. Bye bye